Hey guys, welcome back to channel and in this video, we are going to find out a keyword which is having a very low difficulty and you can easily target as a beginner or for your commercial purpose. So if you're new to this channel and willing to learn more about keyword research technique, backlink strategies, search engine optimization, passive income and affiliate income ideas, then do subscribe this channel because I'm going to share more and more videos on that. So guys, without wasting time, let's go to screen and there we will use a tool with the name of SAMrush to find out that cool keyword which you can easily rank so let's go to screen so guys here you can see on the screen so basically if you're new to this channel and willing to learn a blogging in just nine days then come to my site bloggingos.com provide your name and email id i will be right in your inbox with nine pdfs to train you in the blogging now guys without wasting time let's go to the tool which we will be using for keyword research with the name of samrush if you're unaware what is SAMrush, how to use SAMrush, why you should use SAMrush, then there is a video in the i button which I prepared earlier to this video just to give you a brief overview why you have to use SAMrush and what are the different different tools. But today we are going to use it's one of the most powerful tool and the name of the tool is Keyword Magic Tool. Why we are using? Because that tool will help us to find out a keyword which you can easily rank, easily target and can get easily benefit out of it. So guys, you have to come, you have to first log into SEMrush there you will get a seven day free trial. The link will be in the description. You can easily join in. Now guys, there you have this many different, different tools. Out of that, we will be more focusing on keyword analytics and under that there is a keyword magic tool. We can do is simply come here and there are all the tools listed. So there is one tool with the name of keyword magic. Simply you have to click to keyword magic then automatically under keyword analytics, this tool will pop up. It will directly go to keyword magic tool, but what our focus is to find out a keyword. So first we will go to overview. Now, as you will go to overview guys, our first part is you are totally blank. You don't know what to write, which keyword to type, target and what exactly you can do that. So in that case guys, what we will do is just you have your own seed keyword. Seed keyword, you can imagine this as a title or something, ideas for which you exactly wanted to write. So let's imagine I wanted to write something about search engine optimization because I'm a service provider company who is actually selling some SEO services, right? So what I can do is I can write a content which is more about SEO and then after I can refer people to join my services. So ultimately you have to find out a keyword for which you can rank in the top 10 results of Google. So why can't we use a seed keyword which is let's imagine SEO. So I type here SEO. In this way guys you can type here up to 100 different different keywords which are interrelated to each other. So it will check all those 100 keywords and out of its 20 billion keyword database it will give you all the suggestions based on countries. So what you have to do is simply you have to type your keyword then after guys for which country you wanted to target. So there are all the countries listed United States, United Kingdom, Australia, Germany, France, whatever you can think of more than 140 country database SAMrush has which is amazing. So now what I will do is let imagine I wanted to target only United States. So I will come here and choose the country United States and simply click to analyze. As I will click to analyze guys, this tool will give us complete idea about this keyword. So let's go and drill down this particular keyword. What is the meaning of this data in case you haven't seen my previous video. So first of all, guys, this is the country. This is the desktop version and this is the currency. So basically whatever data you can see here, it is all coming from the reference database of United States only. Okay. So now in the United States, SEO is a keyword. 135k is the monthly search volume this many are the people average people typing in the google seo keyword so you got a good idea whether this keyword is having any search volume or not ideally it is recommended to target a search volume which is all approx thousand because the more the search volume the higher will be competition but anyways we will discuss it later so you got a good idea what is search volume then after this is the criteria for which we are using samrush so what exactly this tool will does Actually, this will this tool will do the analysis of all the top 10 ranking pages. So if you will scroll down guys, these are the 10 pages which are actually ranking in Google. So one of the most important tool or company which is ranking is Moz. Another one is Search Engine Land. Third one is Wordstream. So these are most powerful website. And if these websites are ranking in Google, then obviously the competition for this keyword will be very high. And that will be rated here in the scale of 1 to 100. Something which is closer to 100 will be marked as a higher difficulty. Something which is closer to 1 will be marked as a lower difficulty. And they have given a suggestion. If you target a keyword which is having a keyword difficulty less than 39%, 
then obviously you as a beginner can target. But obviously this is 78% which is falling in the band of hard. So we are not going to target it. So in this way guys, you will get a good idea and this is all about your search engine optimization difficulty. That means the difficulty to be in the top 10 position. Now, little bit down here and there you can see CPC and competition. What is CPC? If on your website you are displaying any sort of ad, Google AdSense ad, then if somebody will click to any sort of ad, then how much potential money you can make for each individual click. That is called CPC, which is $6.5. And this is obvious because number of people are targeting this query, this particular keyword. Now guys, this is the competition, which actually helpful for those people who wanted to place a bid in the Google AdWord for running their ad campaign, which is not much of our use. Now guys, this is a global volume. So what is the global volume? You remember guys, the search volume of this keyword in the United States is 135K, but not the only country is using this keyword. There are multiple people from India, Hong Kong, Japan, and Germany, and a lot many other countries are also searching same keyword in their search engine. And that's why the total global search volume of this keyword is 932K approx, which could be higher than that or could be lesser than that. You got a good idea. Now, what is this result on surf? If you will click to this one, what this tool will does is actually it capture a screenshot whenever this tool has crowded the United States desktop version of you United States Google and there you can see for this keyword more than 619 million pages are written to target this query so this is amazing so guys, this is the data you can read it from here but from this what exactly you got an idea okay this keyword is very much competitive we have to find out something else so how you can do that how you can find out a keyword which is a low hanging keyword which you can target for your website. So there is how for us, this is much, much, much more helpful. There are different ways to use this tool, but I'm going to give you one method. Okay. And then after, if you really wanted me to make more then give me a comment. So I will make more video on that. So that you can see guys, there is a question type of keyword. There is different keyword variation using the same type of seed keyword and always target a keyword which is having a number of words more than three or three and four, because that keyword will obviously have a less search volume, but less competition. So my first bet or the preferable bet is to solve the problem of the people, right? So why can't we check the questions? So simply click to this one. It has uh, actually retrieved more than 25,000 keywords from the United States database, which are actually using your primary keyword SEO. So what happened is basically this tool will pull all the data from its database, which is actually using the primary keyword SEO. You have to wait here a little bit of time and then after you will be, uh, I mean, landed on this particular page with this much data. So I will give you a brief idea how you can read it. So basically, if you will target this keyword, this keyword has United States search volume of 18,000. But if you wanted to check for United Kingdom, simply place your filter and all this data will change. So our focus is to target US. If your focus is to target UK or different country, place the filter accordingly. Then after guys, there you can see this is the search volume. This is the trend, whether this keyword is a search evergreen keyword, which is being searched throughout the year or not. If this is lower or downward, then obviously you don't have to target this one, right? Then after guys, this is the keyword difficulty as we seen earlier. We just checked for SEO, that was 78%. But if you will target what is SEO, which is again very much competitive, approx 77%. Then after guys, this is the CPC, this is the competition and 660 million pages are ranking for this keyword. So now what we have, we have more than 24,836 keyword, which are broad match. Broad match, SEO will be somewhere in that complete sentence, okay? So in this four sentence, you can see SEO. But if you are exactly searching for exact match, obviously one word for exact match somewhere, anywhere, it will be exact match. Now what we can do is you can scroll it down, but no, we are not going to target this keyword. We have to drill down it narrow because this is very much competitive. So the first filter we can come here and then place a filter. And the filter will be, we have to find out a keyword. The keyword which has a keyword difficulty as suggested should be in the range of zero to 39%. So you have to type minimum zero and maximum 39% and click to apply filter. Now what happened is, earlier we were having a record of 24,000 keyword in the question one, but this time obviously it will be less because now it will give us, give us only that data which is having a keyword difficulty percentage of less than 39%. Now you can scroll down guys and there you can see, we have multiple keyword which you can target. The first keyword is, how much does SEO cost in Australia? The second one is why choose our SEO service? Imagine guys, 
you basically searching for or, or you basically ta, ta, or SEO service provider company. So there are people who are actually typing in Google, why choose our SEO service? So actually they wanted to know is there is any SEO service which is actually explaining this reason. If they found it relevant, then obviously you will get that customer or that client. So in this way, guys, instead of targeting only SEO, you can target a full phrase of why choose our SEO service. And this has a keyword difficulty of 32 and having a monthly search volume of 70. Don't bother about 70 because this 70 is for this exact search. But obviously it includes SEO, it includes SEO service, it includes services, our SEO. So once your post will start ranking for this keyword, automatically other keyword will also get ranked. So don't imagine like ultimately you will get only 70 traffic. No, if you your website is ranking for this keyword, automatically it will also ranking for another keyword combination. So in this way, guys, there is again keyword how to crack Yoast SEO premium. There you can see do image help SEO. So again, you can write a content about do image right, uh, image help SEO. Then in this way, guys, you got a good combination of ideas. So this is the one way. What you can do is you can place a filter of zero to thirty nine percent. Now instead of targeting only SEO, you can target this much variations. Now the, again, next part is no, I don't want it to target a keyword which is having a search volume of twenty. I wanted to target something which is having more than that search volume. So what you can do is you can come here and place a filter of something which is more than 20 and in the range of uh, or simply you can target something which is having a search volume of more than 50 only. Okay, then after anything, simply click to apply filter. Now it will only display the keyword which are having the search volume more than 50. Okay, not less than 50. Earlier we saw here there were a keyword of 20, 30, 40 search volume. But this time we have only four keyword ideas which is having a search volume more than 50. So why choose our SEO service and how much does SEO cost in Australia in case of Australia is if your website service is uh, something in Australia as well. So in this way guys, you will get a good idea of which keyword you can target. Now, what exactly we can do here is, this is one method, right? The another method is guys, you can find out the site. Let's imagine this is the site, okay? Backlinko, which is, we are very much aware, like this is one of the most popular site in the SEO. So you can come here and then come down here and why can't we type here, just cancel it, come here, domain overview. This is another method which you can use for keyword research. Simply come here, provide the domain name which you copied from there, okay? And then simply search. So basically this time what we are doing is, we are trying to find out for which keyword this website is ranking. And then again, we will place the same filter. So as you will type this particular search volume, it will actually pull up all those keywords. 124K is the keyword ranking in this website in the United States. You have to come down guys, and there you will be having this option, top organic keyword. So these are the keywords for which this website is ranking in the Google. So what we have done is, Basically, we try to identify for which keyword this site is ranking and then simply place a filter into this website the way we have done in the keyword magic tool. So now you can down here and all the keywords for which this site is ranking will be displayed there. But obviously we are not going to target everything. What we will do is come here and place those filter. So our filter will be like, let imagine there is our filter will be uh, there. You can scroll it down and there is a keyword difficulty, something which is less than and there you can type those 40%. As you will type 40%, then out of all the 53,000 keywords for which this site is ranking in US, only those keywords which is having a keyword difficulty less than 40% will be displayed there. So instead of targeting any random keyword, you can do further keyword research by picking up the keyword from this list. So you can see link outreach services. So you can target this keyword, link outreach services. And for this keyword, the monthly search volume is 40. The keyword difficulty is very less. So instead of targeting SEO service, you can also target link outreach services and there you can explain about your SEO service. Similarly, you have another keyword and different different keyword SEO marketing at Oxford, SEO outreach agency. Again, the next part, you are a SEO company, right? So why can't you target a keyword SEO outreach agency, which has a search volume of 90 and keyword difficulty 38% as per H, as per SEMrush. The keyword which is having a difficulty level less than 39% is worth targeting. So in this way, guys, you can use this tool SEMrush and for this tool, you can get a seven day free trial. The link will be in the description and then you can explore a lot. And if you really like this, then you can continue with this tool with its uh, normal subscription of $95 per month basis, whatever it keeps changing. But there is a seven a day free trial. You can get it from the link given in the description. You can try, you can test, you can experience. If you really found this helpful, you can continue using this tool. Why? Because this tool has 20 billion database, 20 billion keyword database, and you can filter it based on your country, based on devices, whether desktop, mobile, 
etc so i hope guys you enjoy this video and if this is so stay tuned for the more videos and subscribe this channel like this video comment in the comment box what what you like the most and what exactly your further queries if you really wanted me to make more videos on samrush do provide your comments so i will keep making more and more videos i hope guys you enjoy this lesson if this is so stay tuned for the future as well thank you very much for being a part of this channel thank you